Ever pondered over the term bagging in machine learning? Does it sound like a jargon that's hard to comprehend? Well, fear not, because today we're diving deep into this intriguing concept, breaking it down into digestible chunks. Let's start with the full form of bagging, bootstrap aggregation. The name itself provides a hint to its function. It's an ensemble machine learning algorithm that combines the results of multiple models to get a generalized result. Consider a scenario. Suppose you're trying to figure out the best movie to watch this weekend. You ask your friends, check out online reviews, and even refer to popular movie rating platforms. In the end, you make an informed decision based on a consensus of all these different sources. This is somewhat similar to what bagging does in machine learning. It creates multiple subsets of the original data, trains a model on each, and then aggregates their predictions to produce a final result. Now let's break down the two key terms here, bootstrap and aggregation. Bootstrap, in the machine learning context, refers to the method of sampling. It's like drawing straws, but with a twist. After each draw, you replace the straw, meaning you could pick the same one multiple times. This method allows for the creation of varied subsets from the original data. Next comes aggregation. After bootstrapping, models are trained on these subsets. The predictions from all these models are then aggregated. Typically, this involves taking a simple majority vote for classification problems or an average in the case of regression problems. So, why use bagging? One of the main reasons is to reduce the variance of a prediction. By averaging several models, bagging can significantly reduce the chance of an unfortunate selection of a bad model. It also helps to avoid overfitting, a common problem where a model performs well on training data but poorly on unseen data. Summing up, bagging or bootstrap aggregation is a powerful ensemble machine learning algorithm. It works by creating multiple subsets of the original data through bootstrapping, training a model on each, and then aggregating their predictions. The primary goal is to improve the stability and accuracy of machine learning algorithms. Remember, bagging is not a silver bullet for all machine learning problems, but it's a useful tool to have in your data science arsenal. It's like having a team of experts at your disposal, each offering their unique perspective, leading to a more robust and reliable final decision. So, the next time you stumble upon a complex problem in machine learning, don't forget about bagging. It might just be the solution you're looking for. That's all for today's exploration of bagging in machine learning. Stay curious, keep learning, and until next time, keep those algorithms crunching.